Good morning, good afternoon, or good night, or whatever time it may be in your part of the world. My name is Mr. John Wayne, and I am a variety gamer. I play everything from the Fallout franchise all the way to the Soulsborne series. Welcome, everybody, to another episode of my Final Fantasy 16 playthrough. I hope you're all doing well. I know that I am. And today, we're actually going to start on the main quest, Here Be Monsters. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. Back again, Lord Rosfield. I'm touched that you should find me such good company. <sighs> it is not your company, but your counsel that I seek on this occasion. Ah, <sighs> ever the charmer. What will it be today, then? The Iron Kingdom. I need to know what to expect. You'll soon be setting sail for Drake's breath, then, I take it. The Mother Crystal that rises from the boiling sea. There was a time when a true-blooded Rosarian had only to brave the waves to visit it. But then the Ironblood made their move. As you know, the Iron Kingdom rules over the islands to the west of Storm. Or rather, its church does. But this is not the pragmatic approach to state religion employed by the Holy Empire to manipulate the masses. No, the Iron Kingdom is the literal embodiment of the crystalline orthodoxy. And so, if one is to understand it, one must start there. As the name implies, the orthodoxy holds the Mother Crystal sacred, and they do not take kindly to heathens plundering the objects of their worship for the means to fill wash tubs and light lamps with frivolous feats of magic. Indeed, the faithful consider ether a sinful thing, a poison no less. And to them, a dominant is an instrument of evil, albeit one they have proven only too happy to turn against their enemies. Some 80 years ago in Northern Storm, Drake's eye collapsed. Soon after, in pursuit of Aether and with the Blight at their backs, the Northern Territories descended upon the Grand Duchy of Rosaria. And when the Shields of the Flame marched north to meet them, the Iron Kingdom spied an opportunity. A few short days later, the Crusaders landed on the island of Mount Drastanus, home of Drake's breath, and plucked it from the Duchy's grasp. Rosaria tried to reclaim it, of course, but to no avail. I doubt more than a handful of duchy men have set foot on its shores in your lifetime. Nor are they like to again, under the Empire's stewardship, meaning the Iron Blood will keep their island, and with it, the foothold they need to march on mainland soil when next they spy an opportunity. The Mother Crystal is both the object of the Iron Blood's worship and their gateway to the continent, making Drustinus the holiest of holy grounds, from which the Orthodox Crusade shall one day sail forth to claim the remaining Mother Crystals, or die trying. My father and my grandfather both traded blows with the Iron Blood for control of Drek's breath. Had things unfolded differently at Phoenix Gate, we would have sent our entire fleet against them. But instead, they sent their fleet against Rosaria. Sacked the capital. Killed the men. And captured the women, including Jill. I'd say you'd be forgiven for wanting a little revenge, Clive. My only aim is to destroy the Mother Crystal. But... Thank you all the same. Not much else to do here. Let's see if Jill's ready. I want to say that's probably Sid's daughter. I don't know. Just makes me seem like that's who that is. Typical nobles. It will be over soon. 
one way or another. You ready? I think so. Jill. When you told me you had to come to terms with your past, you weren't talking about destroying Drake's breath, were you? No. I spoke of Imran, the leader of the Crystalline Orthodox, the man who made me do all those unspeakable things. I'm going to kill him. It's what I need to do to put the past behind me. What I need... to move forward. And I know that I can do it. If you're there beside me. Always. And I'll be beside you, too. We'll bring down the Mother Crystal together. All while Sid looks on. We'll make him proud. Useful trick. Freezing and thawing the spray to make mist. How did you learn to use your powers like this? The Masters made me do it. When the Crusaders took to the seas to keep the fleet's movements from prying eyes. <clears throat> I'm fine. No, you're not. This may be the only chance I get to go back. My only chance to put things right. I have to do this. Whatever the cost. All right. There she is. The Iron Kingdom's Mother Crystal. Drake's breath. Strong currents, sharp rocks, and ether floods. Let's not forget them. This island is a natural fortress. But safety breeds complacency, allowing a single rowing boat to slip in unseen. The sanctuary is inside the mountain. If we follow the old trail, we should be able to enter by the back gate. All right. Let's go. I always imagined when I came here it would be to reclaim it. It used to belong to Rosaria, didn't it? Once, though it's been in the Ironblood's clutches for far too long. As was I. For 13 years, this rock was my home. I know its secrets only too well. This path was abandoned after an ether flood. They don't guard it anymore. The perfect little shortcut. I really hope Jill does not die.
They're all Akashic. The Aether Flood must have spread. It was never as bad as this before. And the only way past them is through them. all the time. That wasn't even a bad one. It's nothing to worry about. Stay down! I wonder if I can go up there. I don't think so, but... Yeah, no. Take out the dogs first. The old Arboretum is just up ahead. We'll enter the caves from there. Don't see any treasure chests around. Man, that is massive. I say I don't see a treasure chest I find a treasure chest with an accessory hmm yeah no not really worried about it oh yeah not gonna Use Braveheart. <clears throat> oh, look at this place. What a mess. Wait.
It's turned. Nothing a shield of Rosaria can't handle. Just like old times. Be sure to keep clear of its more. Believe me, I mean to. Oh, that's foul. Don't breathe it in. Too slow. Oh, good lord. That's new. Oh, I need to move back. I remember that attack. Nice try. This Malbro seems a little easier than what it should. Too slow. Press on? Yes. (sighs) 
It's like a furnace in here. We're inside the volcano. You get used to the heat. Though I don't remember it being quite this hot. Was that one cause for concern? It was. And they're getting bigger. Something's wrong. <sighs> Stay down! <laughs> Enough! <laughs> Guess I wasn't close enough to that scorpion. Okay, I was like, oh wait, what is that? Just some scorpions. No big deal. Curious on what's down there then. Does it do a big circle? I keep saying like things do a big circle, but it would really be just a roundabout. No mistakes. Too slow. I think this just leads back to where we were earlier. Stay down. But I'm just gonna double check. Alright, we got a potion out of it, so. And some experience. You can never have enough experience, that's for sure. Fuck. Is there no other way across? Yeah, I wouldn't be standing on that. <sighs> Come on. 
quickly before it melts. This is going to be close. Come on. Let's not do that again. No. Let's not. They don't look too tough. Perhaps not alone. But in numbers like these... Wait up! Take care of these bombs as fast as I can. Don't want them exploding on me. Um, there's multiple ways to go. Well, we aren't going this way. Let's look for another path. Never mind. <laughs> There's one way to go. Drake's breath. We're nearly at the oratory. What the hell is that? I have absolutely no idea. Well, whatever it is, I don't think it's friendly. Give me thunder! Too slow. Nice try. Whoa. else did we get for gear? Yes, please. We didn't get a new weapon. I'm sure we will soon. the lava if I didn't know better I think this volcano was about to erupt why attack us though they're peaceful creatures then this one must be the exception <laughs> <laughs> Let's try. 
Doing? Nothing good, I'll wager. Too slow. Oh my goodness, I could not see there. That was crazy. Got knocked out of that animation. Oh well. Stand fast. Damn, this thing is fucking me up. We need to um, use our ability points. Are you hurt? It's just hot. Thank you. Quite a commotion our friend made. Let's hope the guards didn't hear it. The gate to the inner chambers is just up there. Then we make for the sanctuary. I need to finish this. Before the heat finishes me. Here, here. We'll enter the Comric by the Handmaiden's living quarters. It was always a hive of activity. Sounds like we'll have a hard time staying out of sight. We won't have to. There's someone there I should very much like to see. Okay, so before we go any further, we're actually going to end the video. But before we do, let's go ahead and spend some ability points. Number one, I want to max that out right there. And then... I don't know if I want to get any of these... Just because I don't ever use any of this stuff. Even though I really should. But maybe, um... Get some of this stuff. Actually, you know what? No. We'll upgrade this. And then after we upgrade that, we'll upgrade that as well. 
Yeah. Sounds good. That looks cool. Oh, that looks super cool. Oh, well. Maybe we'll get that one of these days. Alright, now that we have leveled up some of our abilities, and now we have four bars for our limit break, which is super awesome, we can go ahead and end the video. So I want to start by telling everybody thank you so very much for stopping by and watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. If you didn't, hit the thumbs down button. Let me know why down in the comments below. It only helps the channel. Also, if you enjoy content just like this, be sure to subscribe or don't. I don't know. I'm not your dad. Do whatever you want. And like always, everybody, have a good morning, a good afternoon, or good night. Whatever time it may be in your part of the world, Mr. John Wayne, signing off.